Hey travelers, if you're as crazy about anime and Japan as I am, then you're in for a treat that's hotter than Deluxe Flames and sweeter than Venti's Melodies. Before we dive headfirst into the Prima Gems, get ready for something special that'll tickle your taste buds and satisfy your wanderlust. A huge shout out to Tokyo Treats and Sakurako for sponsoring this video. Now you must be wondering what they are. Well, Tokyo Treats and Sakurako are monthly subscription boxes delivered straight to your door from Japan, allowing you to experience the flavors of Japan from the comfort of your own home. As you can see here, we have these two extremely beautiful boxes. The first one we will open is Tokyo Treats. With Tokyo Treats, you'll get 20 of the latest, most exclusive limited edition and seasonal Japanese flavored snacks that are only available in Japan for a limited time. This month's limited edition box theme is Fireworks Flavor Fest. We got some really fun stuff like Salt Lemon Kit Kats, which taste so good. You don't feel a lot of the salt, but I don't know how to explain the feeling other than to say it's just delicious. Salt Lemon Pretz, Osan Po Cotton Candy, and prepare for a surprising twist with the mystery flavored Fanta. No cap, this had me guessing my existence as every sip I took had a different flavor. At first it felt like grapes, but later it felt like apples. It's probably my mind playing tricks on me, but it's just so good. Now on to Sakurako, which focuses on supporting local Japanese snack makers. It also comes with 20 traditional, authentic, and artisan snacks, including Japanese tea, which tasted so good that I gave my mom a sip and she drank almost full, a special Japanese item, and more. This month's limited edition box theme is the Festivals of Okinawa. We got some tasty stuff like Okinawan Salt Senbei, Pineapple Mochi Manju, and Red Tomato Arare all pairs excellently well with the floral Okinawa Sanpin tea. I really like how Sakurako snacks feel authentic and artisanal, and check out this cool special item, the Bingata Uchiwa, a popular bamboo fan dish. Now I know most of you all thought about the Uchiha clan from Naruto. The impact of anime is real, isn't it? If you don't know what an item is, both boxes include a cool pamphlet that will explain each snacks, the ingredients, and include some info on Japanese culture. If you want to try next month's box or get it as a gift for your loved ones, click the links in the description below and use the code CHIBI for $5 off either box. Now let's get into the Prima Gems. If you want the short answer, which I totally understand why you want, it's 13340 Prima Gems, but this includes every single Prima Gem we can earn in 4.0. Now a normal human being won't be able to get 13340 Prima Gems in one go. So I'll explain what you can really expect. Dailies will us a total of 2,520 Prima Gems. Three small events and the main event of 4.0 will give us a total of 2,240 Prima Gems. You also get a free Bennett and a free Lynette. The Spiral Abyss will reset three times and taking floor 11 as the end, we get 1,350 Prima Gems. We will have one shop reset, which gives us five intertwined fates or 800 Prima Gems. Archon quests, story quests, exploration, the statue of the seven, fountain leveling, which in short will function like a sigil reward system in Fontaine, and more will give us a total of 4,285 Prima Gems. Achievements give a total of 515, and the tutorial will give 30 Prima Gems. 80 Prima Gems from five star character test runs, 60 Prima Gems from Hoyo Lab daily check in. 600 Prima Gems from bug fixes and maintenance, 300 Prima Gems from the 4.1 special program live stream. I won't be adding this, but just to mention that you can get up to 180 Prima Gems from web events, codes, and Twitch drops in 4.0. So in total, we get around 12,780 Prima Gems, which translates to 79.8 wishes. But I know some people will explore and do everything that 4.0 has to offer, so for them, you can get up to 83 wishes. 63 wishes in the first half. So have you been saving up for your favorite character? Will you wish on 4.0? And last but not least, thank you again to Tokyo Treats and Sakurako for sponsoring this video. You can find all the links in the description. So what do you think? Comment down your thoughts, and while you are at it, like and sub too. Oh, and turn on the notifications as well so you don't miss out on anything. Thank you for watching.